Hello everybody, welcome back to FTL Mod Roulette. Last episode, we're run with Magpie script out of victory. Which is great. Time to canoe ship and third time's a charm. More on that later. Three, two, one. We get 186. With us PK and Cap Magician. 186. Which is... 186. Can't find 106 because I used the wrong shortcut. Viper by Dry Eagle updated for a E by Rat82. Mm. Well, let's hope third time the charm. See you in a bit. All right, so we got lucky and actually found something that still worked. Hence, I'm what I meant to with uh, third luck, third times the chart. Mm. First time I ended up at a ship that was no longer available for download, unfortunately. Anyway, um, let's have a look at him, the Viper. Alright, so two shield layers from the start seems powerful. Venom. Get two of those. Take two power, it seems. Deadly venom will burn and paralyze your enemies from the inside. Um uh, shield piercing is potent. Just per valley one, shield piercing five, ion damage one. Nothing really about crew damage, so. Basically, just starts fire, so it's like a fire missile kind of thing. I'm assuming both are the same. Yeah, we got a boarding drone as well to finish off when everything's burning and such. All right, um, let's get to it then. Let's see what's actually on here. Uh, list: Viper, small, powerful, solid class cruiser, sacrifice secondary systems for strong weaponry and defenses. Uh, full. <laughs> Apparently, a lot of people did uh, playthroughs with this one. Well, I guess I'll finally join the ranks. This post was updated lastly on August 7, 2013. So, hmm. well, let's get it done. Oh, yeah, custom flagship. Let's see the data. Uh, quite dense, a lot of rooms, concert in the middle of the ship, vulnerable for inaccurate all weapons. Alright. Speed enhanced drone system. That's it, okay. So no hacking, my control, cloaking. Cloaking and my control at the final end. So we never have to deal with hacking, which is gonna be acceptable, I guess. A light quad my launcher that can only deal hull damage. A swarm missile battery that cannot damage systems effectively. Okay. So he's gonna rush down my hull with those two up in the middle there. It's not gonna be a fun fight, I think. Ah oh, well. Uh, spend with ion weapon and a heavy ion weapon. So ions and missiles for the final fight, alright. Standard, heavy, and a boarding. Okay. System casing and O2 masks. All right. Here's a boarding drone. Can't use it though. <laughs> uh, good stuff. All right. Let's see what the venom can do. We don't have to fight off against too many. Missile launcher, so we don't. Alright. So I guess we'll uh, start them off with one of these. We don't need to worry about their shields, so we're not going to. Green shields might be a little bit annoying, actually. You know, thinking that's a Zoltan shield. We can never get a Zoltan shield, so maybe it's not that big of a concern, but I don't think it's worth mentioning. So as long as you don't deal with the ice ships, this is actually quite strong. You know, being able to pierce through all shields without a problem can be relatively potent. Um, I don't know what's available for purchase here. Um, by that I mean as far as systems go, so I can't, don't know if you can hack, hacking my control, teleporter, blah blah blah. A teleporter might be worth it though. We'll have to be a bit careful. A 
he should be dead soon. I don't know what the fire chance is though. Which is the main reason I'm looking to get sensors going as well. A lot of them died. Now we get a burst mark four, meaning we have something against the ice ships. Sweet. That was quick. Um let's Wow, fifty, huh? Oof. We'll probably want to do that and get a defense run up. We're gonna be facing off against a lot of miss missiles. Are we safe against you? We are. You're gonna board us, which is really not a smart thing for you to do. These can keep auto firing. I don't even need to worry about their weapons. We might as well keep them firing so these two can level up a bit. Uh, we'll go with that, I suppose. Lesson learned. I do have the special weaponries for SMPK up, so apparently that beam has shield piercing. There you go. Well, yeah, we may want to get proper sensors in rather soonish. Zoltan's dead. Trying to run, which is gonna kind of be easy. When everything's on board, when everything on board is like kind of on fire. Um, we buy an engines upgrade. Yeah, we have to at some point. You know, we're also playing Captain's Editions. Ah, I don't actually know if it's still a problem. It might be. I don't know. Yeah, we'll attack, and this is why we have the burst. Nothing to fear but fear itself. And since you don't have a fear gun or whatever, we should be safe against you. Might take a while before we completely kill it, but well, two volleys will hopefully do it. So, what systems would we be looking forward to buying? There's something to be said about a teleporter, but honestly. With the weapons we currently have, we really won't have much problems of killing crew. I guess we'll just have to wait and see, right? Long gone. Alright, uh, we'll try to scrounge up some scrap, see if we can buy sensors. It's unmanned captain, don't see anyone, this does not seem right, I advise caution. Well, at least can end badly for you if you take that blue option. Sure, we'll demand this render of their goods. They're probably going to try to run straight away, but that's the way how the world works. We'll hit both on there. We don't need to worry their weapons. And if we hit Lionize, they're piling, meaning they can't run. But a bit of luck will set it on fire as well. Good. Just keep it up, I guess. Keep the fire burning and keep as many of those dudes stunned as we can. It'll eventually leave the med bay. And at that point, this will be over. Free fire everything. Keeping their weapons online again. Try to get some evasion done. Why the hell is he still trying to take care of fires? Probably because I don't know. He just killed himself. Well, shields were on fire as well, so 
I guess he tried to sacrifice himself, which wouldn't really help much. Anyway. And he'd be dead soon as well. He was already injured. Yep. Um, yeah, sure, let's take him. See if he can pick up... Uh, do we want it? If I go here, it'll go here, go here, it'll go here. This might entail a rebel fleet advance though, so we're gonna have to be a little bit careful. Looks like rebels kill a little better on men, military vessel in the neutral zone, it was fired on to arrive. And there's our first missile, so everything will be fired on or there. It should ionize, it should ionize both weapons because of the way iron damage works. Yeah, there you go. Takes off one weapon, gets ionized again, takes off another. And since they only have two, both weapons are gone. We'll just keep going until the whole place... Are you gonna go and help? Huh. Interesting. They just moved places for whatever reason. They're still on good health, it seems. We really do want to get sensors going, though. Might even want to put the shield guy on sensors then, so I don't have to upgrade them straight away myself. But seeing where I'm starting fires is just a little bit too important to ignore. I can see it from where the enemy crew is going, but... I still don't know how much firing is in there, you know? Should be dead soon. Okay, man. Yeah, there he goes. And did we start a fire here? Yes, we did. We're done. There's still the rebel ship. You hear shouts in the corridors. Remaining cadets managed to escape their holding cells and attempt to escape to the rebel ship while they are still docked. Oh, that's. They're trying to escape. Let's go for their drone control. Because that's how you get off this ship by going to drone control. I just realized we do not have airlocks. You're gonna be fine, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, we do have airlocks right here. We just don't have the rover door control. Okay, here, 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 maybe here. Yeah, that'll work, I think. Um, he'll... Yeah, he'll trade. You don't have to worry about fuel too much more. Well, at least not for a little while. Limit time offer, list of available systems. I kind of want to see if it's available, though. So clone base, fine. Crew teleporters, fine. Yeah, I'm gonna wait until I find sensors because I don't know if I want to just go up and buy something. How many rooms do we still have? One, two, three, four, five. One, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, it's gonna be. Um, is there anything that can tell me which systems are available to be bought though? You can get doors, you can get sensors. I'm reading this off a screenshot I'm looking at, so... <laughs> yeah, doors and sensors are good. Teleporter as well. Okay. Well, now we know. Any mo. Let's hope this one isn't empty, though. Uh, we will never send our crew. All right, time to burn. Plenty of engines, which is annoying, but you know, what are you gonna do? So I make sure that they aren't going anywhere anytime soon. We'll keep everything going, again. Evasion. And 
Maybe some shield experience. This is gonna take a while though. Because of the blasted NGs. In the meantime, I can look a bit further to see what uh, can be done. Yeah, I only see the one screenshot for the time being. And on that screenshot there are doors and sensors available. The other screenshots we can take use of... No, it doesn't look like it. Um, no, I don't think so. How are we doing on this side? The human gave up on things, the NG... This one did as well. Which means you're the only one that's still, like, even remotely healthy. Right, you should be going down quickly, too. Uh, either he's just... Uh, okay. He gave up on life as well. Alright, to just start pegging. Whatever is left. Okay, where are you going? Okay. You might live, yeah. Okay, you're probably dead. I think you're gonna be dead too. There we go. Uh, let's get an NG on board. Fast repairs and all that good stuff. <clears throat> right, time to leave. Uh, let's go abandoned. I'd rather not deal with nebulas. And again, abandoned sector. I don't know about this one. You know, Lionius and such. Look, there's already be five computers for your crew members as first quarters relaxing. There it goes. Uh, sure. That has been updated. Well, it's something. We still always have the burst laser there in order to do some shenanigans. Um, tag slaver scum, we'll go for weapons. If both hit, they'll both take out. And they did. Okay. Uh, let's actually have you man the engines then. And yeah, you can. Uh, Run around pretending that you got an important job and keeping borders offline. Oh, and they do have a Lanius. Um, it's gonna be interesting getting him killed. He will take fire damage, but you gotta keep in mind though, he'll drain the oxygen, which means fire isn't gonna do all too much against him. And without functioning sensors, it's gonna be quite difficult to know what the butts is going on there. Yeah. Take out fires. We'll see if he can keep his oxygen going. That's probably going to be the best thing we can do here. I don't think the guy has too much more health left, but again, we can't really tell. There he goes. Um, I suppose we take another Mantis. But are we really gonna go... Let's take a Rockman. For blue options and stuff, you know. I 
that. We got a store over there. We'll go buy sensors. Good dodge. That's only 20% chance. I mean, what can you really expect? Then? The sad part being is that that thing is like constantly. Synced up. You got injured. We're not gonna get shot at anymore anyway, so we may as well go and heal you. Alright, let's get them sensors in. Missile defense drone, it's cheap. Uh, can we get hacking? Yes, we can. We can also buy a land just for whatever reason. Um, yeah, I'll take these. This one ain't great, but you know, it's something. So, what do we want to do here? See if this thing works. It's not gonna be easy, it's gonna take for freaking ever. I suppose I could have upgraded. Wep um, you know what I mean? Um, Drogue Control and to get the boarding drone in there, but you know, it's a little too little too late, so to say. Um, this will work, however, it will take like three hours to do as such, so. Being the gregarious person that I am, I'm gonna cut here and get back to you once they are all dead. See you in a bit. Right, so it, well, like I predicted, did take quite a while. But we're almost good here. See, the problem is once they're almost dead, they just run straight out of the room. So if you don't get the stun, it's kind of difficult to... Do the thing you want to do, and yeah, I know I can just use the burst them three. And if it doesn't kill him on this one, I will. There we go. And I crew drone MK1. How much power do you use? Also one. Eh. Probably not to immediately jumping to get that boarding drone going anyway. There we go again. Well, pain to say this to you. Uh, are you leveled up? Yeah, you're not fully leveled up. Um, why don't we start treating you as a pilot now? Might as well see how many people we can level up before this becomes an actual problem, if I remember right. Anyway, um, you know the drill. See you in a bit. All right, done. Welcome aboard, Paul. Let's get everyone back into their positions. Move some people around to, you know, get them leveled up as well. Like this guy is almost good on weapons now too. And if, if I eventually end up losing people, which I will, involuntarily, of course. But you know, all right, free gunk. It's kind of weird that there isn't really much we would like to upgrade just yet, but you know. Uh, attack the pirates, let's do this. Ah, oh, you got a rockman. That's lame, but I'll allow it because I don't really have much else that I can do about it. Alright, got a fire over there. We're gonna have to start working on oxygen soon enough, too. Shields I will never have to care about. Oh, don't go to oxygen. Lane. I know. We'll hit the shields room.
forceps. Not knowing that their shield room is actually completely useless to them. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll be I, I guess. Oh well. Air's running out of plentiful of rooms. And I would just need the Rockman to die. I'll probably go to auction right now. Ta -da. Well, this thing can still stun, so might as well. Well, that didn't do much. Well, it still does ion damage, so, you know, there's still that. Oh, he gave up. Pfft. Idiot. He could have made it, probably. He probably still would have died because of the iron damage, but you know, he could have technically lived a little longer there. Probably not. Alright, store, what do we want from here? Well, I guess we'll see what's for sale. Wouldn't mind that our scatter defense. Um, you can just straight up get a fire beam. We don't need this, this. Just go straight through everything anyway. Uh, normal defense drone, yeah. This one's better. Takes three power. Mm. We'll take this one. We'll get rid of the boarding drone. This one's fun, but we don't need it. We'll do that. We'll upgrade. Okay. Here, we'll move to here. We can do this one and then to our exit, I think. Or this one and go to our exit. Or we can go here, 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 right? Here, move to here, here, move to here. Yeah, we'll do this, this, and that. Alright. <sighs> here we go again. Can this one hurt us? Yes, technically it can. Unless we do this. Mm. And then uh, this seems a little bit... And there's a medbay too. Let's not bother. Let's get this one out. A little too much jump cuts anyway. Too many jump cuts. Well, man, blah blah blah, 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 blah accept surrender. And with a bit of luck, our next volley can kill them. If everything hits. Can you hurt me? No, you can't. Well, let's hop to it. Alright, so the NG leveled up completely. Who was that I was training on? Yeah, why don't you go there now? How about you go there? We're gonna get shot at a little while longer, might as well see if we can get anything useful out of it. Shield guy is getting up there. And to be this early in, that means something. At least we can see the fire now, that's a good thing. Alright, everybody back now. Is this what I want? Yeah, I think it is. 
Yeah, he's not stunned, but he's got nowhere else to go. And yet another Mantis. Got the feeling the game really wants to push that uh, teleporter on, but I think that might be a better idea for the Rockman then. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll uh, get my engines upgrade, I guess. NG Homeworlds. Yeah, fine. Uh, socialize. Hit the wrong button, of course. Defensive options. Onboard drones. Uh, nah. Okay, so teleporter might still be valid if you can find another Rockman somewhere. NG crew member. Continue, continue. Da -da 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 -da. Need more scrap if you want a teleporter, so we'll go here first. Okay, let's go. Sure, let's go here. Why not? Have a gamble at it. Limited time, available systems, screw teleporter not available. Well, you can buy one here if you wanted to. Uh, powerful drone equipped with a scale down halberd beam. Not bad, but. I'll get a crew teleporter. Which, oddly enough, will fill up with one Rockman. I think that'll be the best course of action. What are the odds of running out of fuel, right? <laughs> it's not like we had like 20 or something a little while ago. Oh wait, we did. <sighs> That's the game for you. Socialize, Genji, why not? Alright, let's get this done. Red alert, and he's going to try and run. We can send in a Mantis as well for distraction, I suppose. Um, yeah, why not? Guy just doesn't know what to do with his life, huh? Ah, well. Alright, takes care of that. The pyrite. We got four fuel out of that, too. Sweet. Um, pyrite. Let's see. Kind of cannon capture the decoy rebel messenger. It appears to combine elements of both ion and laser technology. Might be useful. A bit odd that there isn't a station here, but what are you gonna do? So we need another rockman, is what you're saying. And again, we've got ourselves a runner. A, a distraction mantis. Your shields are useless and will never help you in any way, shape, or form. Let's see if that sets it on fire. It doesn't. Let's try again. There we go. You guys are gonna run and, and get killed by the mantis because, you know. You're just that smart. He just leaves altogether. Okay. Cool. Done. 
Mm, you're in luck. Blah blah blah. Matches thieves. Blah blah blah. So you may want to. This has a fire chance as well. All right. So it's basically one of these. No, one because you do all damage. Yeah. You're a weird one, huh? It's a bit expensive to get going, though. Uh, what do we get if we do this? <coughs> system casing, right? Do I want system casing, or do I just want to go beat up some more stuff? Let's go beat up some more stuff. Naturally. Invasive maneuvers. This should be easy, and I'm actually just going to send it to Mantis. We're going to stretch this out longer than we have to. We don't even need to shoot at them. Oh, they do system damage. Well, never... Uh, no, you still can't... <laughs> you actually still can't hurt me. be annoying about the whole thing. <sighs> so we need a new guy for shields, which might as well be one of these then. Yeah, let's make a U. Cool. Suppose here, here, here then. Yeah, it's the only thing we can still do. Alright. The I ship? Yeah. And a full pursuit as well. Well. Send out the drone as well, please. We're gonna have to go for shields, because, you know, he's got three layers of them. This might take a while otherwise. Let's see how many shots this thing has, actually, before we decide to do anything. One too many. There we go. That moment you're more concerned about a non-missile launcher than an actual missile launcher. The drone is going to be able to do some good work because you can see the shield layer is tiny. Uh, I think we'll be able to take him out in time. One more volley and he's dead. The question is what goes quicker, we charging up our laser or him blowing up himself? Well. Missed the one shot there. It's, it's kind of terrifying, but I guess we're making it out of here. He's not fixing that quickly. If he is, though, he's gonna get immediately the chance to blow himself, but he didn't. Thank you, the defense drone. Did we really get that crude? Oh, this was a nebula. Nebula, ice field, you know. So why do I keep getting a fleet pursuit on these? The collective nature of the NG beings usually prevents any deviation from absorption norm. That's why NG pirates are a rare sight. I'm going off some supplies to keep quiet about the rare boss, although in this zero interference environment, both ships stand out like supernova. Ah, that will like like explain it, I guess. Do we want to go and kill them? Yeah, we want to go and kill them. Pirates are pirates, right? Yar. He shouldn't last long. Let's move here. Actually managed to get a drone there. Smart. And we 
get Narenji. Do we want Narenji? Yeah. Suppose you can maybe replace Paul. Paul ain't too smart. What was your job here, Paul? I don't even know. Into the exit we go. Yeah, sure. This one can definitely cause some damage. Probably will too. Knowing the game, it's been too long since you've taken some damage, so. There you go. Just say something will happen and it won't. Or, unless it. No, whatever. <sighs> One more volley, <sighs> if we're lucky. There we go. FTL jammer. Well, it's something, I guess. We'll go. It'll have to be rock, though. Uh, I suppose they're easier to kill. Sure. Alright, well, I do think that is going to do it for this episode, though. So thank you guys for watching, hope you're still in the series. Feel free to support by coming, liking, and or something if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.